Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am vlogging today. I haven't vlogged in such a long time. The UK currently has like the worst COVID cases in the world and we are right in the heart of it in London. I'm not really doing anything much. As I said, we're in lockdown, there's nothing to do apart from going for a food shop and going for walks. So um, today is food shop day and that is the most exciting thing that happens during my uh, quarantine life. Um, so that's why I'm vlogging today because I can bring you guys along with me <laughs> to do the food shop. Um, and I want to make some cinnamon rolls today. I actually, I don't make it, True makes it. Um, so I'm gonna see if he will kindly make some cinnamon rolls and I can vlog that because I think that's really nice like vlog content, really nice like homey vibes. Um, but yeah, the sun is shining today, which is so, so nice. I think the whole week is just going to be raining. Um, so I'm just enjoying the sunshine. I'm doing some work. I ordered some pens from Amazon and a little pencil case because I have um, my little journal book and I am trying to be more productive and plan out my days and kind of write to-do lists to get myself motivated. So yeah, that came in today and I'm really happy. I just love like stationery how satisfying is that um but yeah so i'm just gonna bring you along with what i'm doing at home i just put some makeup on because i was trying to film a tiktok but it didn't really go well i'm still learning how to do this whole tiktok thing but yeah if you want to follow me on tiktok guys i mean i don't really have many uh tiktok uploads i'm working on it my username is nuri.anna um but i am i do want to post more on there but yeah so yeah as you can see it will be raining all week and we only have a couple of hours of sunshine left so i'm just gonna enjoy it and make the most of it my makeup today i feel like this is a good makeup day but we're about to head out now to waitrose and to go for our daily walk so i'll just show you what i'm wearing i'm wearing this cashmere jumper which is by free people um it's just so soft and i know it will keep me warm because i'm so cold and then i'm wearing these trousers these are from zara um they're like the asymmetric they're kind of like a jeans slash trousers so i'm just wearing this Know the reason why, yeah. I'm never really satisfied, yeah. Looking up a paradise, yeah. Without you by my side, imagine I walk through your doorway. Imagine skipping all the foreplay. Imagine all the stars in one place. Cause you, you really make me wanna fly. Cross my heart and hope to die. Lonely, you're the reason why. Feel those butterflies when I go to sleep at night
Okay guys, it wouldn't be a vlog, it wouldn't be a vlog without having something to eat in the car. So today's food of choice is mochi. Now, if you guys have been following me for a while and you follow me on Instagram, you know that I've been an OG mochi lover for a very long time now. I'm obsessed with mochi, um, but it's been going viral on TikTok. So as a result of that, it's now unavailable in all the supermarkets, like the actual, the frozen ice cream one. You can't find it anywhere, obviously, power of TikTok. So I've had to resort to the Little Moons mochi, but this is not the ice cream one. This is just the usual one, but it'll do. I love it still. This is the strawberry mochi cheesecake. And let me just move the camera so you can see uh, my darling True. No, I'm going to do like mochi recipe. Oh yeah, okay. I told True that he should make, um, because True has a cooking channel. If you didn't know already, I'm going to leave a link down below. You should subscribe. True, I'm plugging you right now. I told him he should make some mochi on that cooking channel because I would love to see that. So yeah, subscribe and comment on his most recent video and tell him to make mochi, please, so I can eat it. We've obviously sanitized our hands. I use this, um, this is a spray sanitizer. It's by this brand called Let's Sanitize. They gifted me like so many hand sanitizers and I was just like, that is the perfect gifting because in this day and age, hand sanitizer is like the next best thing. But yeah, so it's vegan friendly. You can recycle it. It's like in a glass bottle and it's this is an Oud Noir. So it literally smells like perfume. I really like this. We just keep that in the car. Okay. Oh, True also picked up kombucha. This is the Equinox uh, ginger kombucha. This is two pound fifty-five. It's quite expensive. <laughs> that's really expensive. So that's why you should make it. Then we don't have to buy it. Mm. This is a strawberry cheesecake one. It's not frozen. Okay, but why am I struggling to open this? <laughs> oh, oh! I love the texture of it. Mm. Okay. Mmm. You have to show them the inside. Oh, it's got soft cheese and jam. Mm. It's just such mm. a satisfying thing to eat, isn't it? Let's see how long that can stay there for. Yeah, and risk breaking the camera. We forgot to get the ingredients for. I only realised at checkout, and we're too lazy to go back and do shopping again, but. Um, I realised at checkout that we forgot to get the ingredients for cinnamon rolls so that is not on the agenda tonight but we will make it tomorrow What's there to say? There's nothing but space in between you and I It's okay that we change But it feels kind of strange that you're not in my life You're the only one that saves me when I'm alone
So I'm upstairs now and I thought I would show you like the little bits that I bought. Starting off with the thing that I'm so excited for. It is this su such a cute packaging. 467 calories. Oh my goodness, that's a whole meal. Um, but I'm going to be showing this with true, so it's fine. This is the Percy Pig Muffin because I am obsessed with Percy Pigs. They're my favourite sweet and they're vegan, so that's really good. So I picked up these marshmallows, which are plant-based. And they're actually really nice. I feel like when I first had them, I didn't really like, it didn't taste like marshmallow. I mean, it does, but the texture was weird for me. It was the texture of it. And then I started having more and then I started to enjoy it. So I obviously liked it enough to repurchase it. So we've got those. And then um, these Percy Pig, like little baby Percy Pigs. Again, they're vegan. Oh, not vegan, sorry, vegetarian. And then from Holland and Barrett, um this is what true picked out a uh, decadent date so it's basically dates covered in milk chocolate i picked out um these milk chocolate brazil nuts because i absolutely love them okay so this is the muffin guys it has a little percy pig and then it has this it's like percy pig sauce and then you have this like sponge cake thing okay i should just try, try on the camera let me just try it It just tastes like a basic cake. guys it's the afternoon um i have had a really busy morning which is why i haven't had the chance to really pick up my camera um i was just filming not filming it's taking pictures of some content for my instagram stories i'm working with topshop on instagram stories so i just had to like put on some outfits and try them on um i'll actually show you what i'm wearing now it's a really cute little dress okay so this is the dress this is the dress that i am wearing as part of like my topshop stories it's in this police material um it's really cute i've just styled it with some doc martens um but i think this would be so nice with like a pair of tights and doc martens and you can wear it with heels it's one of those like little black dresses that you can just do so much with um i've just tied it up in a little ribbon but it's just really cute i just thought i'd show you that yeah so i feel like my makeup and my hair looks exactly the same as it did when you last saw me um, but basically my hair is so greasy, so this is the only hairstyle I can do, like literally slick back. So today we are finally making the cinnamon rolls, so we're going to go out and get the ingredients for that and also hopefully go for a walk. So I'm wearing the uh, this on my lips, it's the Dior Lip Glow Oil in the shade Cherry Oil. And it's so pretty, it's kind of like, it's not really sticky, it's just like a lip oil as it says. Um, and it just feels really nice and comfortable on the lips and I really like it, it kind of has this tint it, It's not as harsh as it looks in the bottle. It reminds me a little bit of my Glossier lip gloss that I love But it's less sticky um, So yeah, I'm really liking that. That's what's on my lips today She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her um, okay, so we are about to head out now. Finally, I've done all the things that I need to do, like sent my Topshop stuff for approval and 
did like work admin stuff. So now we are going to Waitrose again to get the cinnamon roll stuff and maybe some stuff for dinner and also go for a walk. Hopefully we'll go for a walk. Um, but this is my outfit of the day, outfit of the evening. I'm wearing this jumper, which is from Topshop. I actually really like it. It's um, like a really nice thick knit and it's got this v-neck and you could also like wear it off the shoulder which is a like cute, nice vibe. And I've just tucked it into these trousers from Miss Guided and I'm wearing them with my Doc Martens. There must be something that features. You'll find her beauty goes much deeper. Once you get to meet her, she's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. I see they don't understand Feeling like Picasso She brushing against my hands Seeing you from around the way You didn't give me the time of day You be making moves that you Who really care what Simon say All the bad things girl I had to look past that I'm wearing True's coat today Yeah Keep Still me nice everything on mine Um so In True True and Nuri style We obviously have some food to eat so today's food of choice is octopus sticks. Octopus on sticks. It's from this Japanese, uh, I think this is the bigger one, you can have this one. With bonito flakes. Mm. And they move. Have you guys tried octopus before? Let me know in the comments down below. Everyone will go to Japan. Mm. I've been watching a lot of K drama. I wanna. Oh yeah, I've always said I wanna go to Korea. We're trying to find the exit because we never come to this car park usually. But this was the only Bad. car park that was open. For dinner today, we're gonna have jacket potatoes because that's what I fancy. Um, I feel like that's a very British meal, jacket potato. Do you think it is? A British meal, do you think other countries have it? Sell it in Costco. Yeah, what does that mean? Is that American? Costco is American. Um, and also guys, I'm so happy we finally got mochi. It's basically sold out in all the supermarkets, but we knew the Japanese store would be the plug. Isn't it? Mm. Say it over and out, true. Over and out, true.
Hey guys, it's Saturday, it's the weekend, so uh, we are going to a food market because it's the only thing that we can do and we love food. Um, it's called Nettle, Nettle Market, uh, it was recommended by a friend and basically it's a market in Hackney so we're going to go check that out, hopefully it's open. It's such a rainy, gloomy day today as you can see in the background. Ever. It's so cold outside and so rainy, but this honestly is a highlight of the day. And the lady was so lovely. Oh, don't spray that. Where should we put this? Give it to me. The lady at the um, who like owns the store, so lovely. What was it called? Sheets Club Dessert Bar. Yeah, she said that they sell kits um, where you can like make your basically. I'll show you what I got. I got the Oreo, oh, the Oreo s'mores. No, did right, I? Yeah. Please. We have this is, the, go on, you tell them what that is. So we have the chocolate with basically 40% dark chocolate, was it? 45% dark yeah. chocolate. And then we have um, marshmallow. marshmallow. So this is what you can actually buy from her website. So it's, all you have to do is fry the donuts. It comes with everything and you just fry it, which is such a good idea. You know what? We've got to get water because this is going to be very sugary. It has um, Oreos inside it. How's the hot chocolate? Very mm. mm. rich. How did you drink it? No, I didn't. <laughs> oh. Did I get some fluff on my nose? Mm-hmm. Mm. Right. Oh my god, true. This hot chocolate is so good. I don't feel like you tried it because you had the marshmallow. It's so nice. Because it's dark chocolate, it's not. It tastes because of the marshmallow fluff. Because of the marshmallow fluff. But if you just drink the chocolate, it's really, it's really nice. So we still have. Oh, where are you going? We still have like more than half a donut left. So now we we are going to Siwu, which is a Chinese supermarket, um, to get. Some glutinous rice flour. Is it called glutinous rice flour? No. Why am I saying glutinous? It is glutinous. Right? Oh, it is. Okay. Ah, right. uh, but they close at four. What's the time? How far is it? There's that Chinese supermarket near, you know, Boba, which is in Hackney. Let's go there. Oh yeah, what's it called? I don't know what it's called, but go type in Boba. We're just moving in circles, but we're losing the shape. 